It's almost a new year, but if you've given up on creating New Year's resolutions because you just can't accomplish them, well, experts say don't give up just yet. KSPY News reporter Kimberly Cruz spoke with some local experts and has some tips that may help you accomplish your goals. But just two days before 2023, you're probably thinking and writing down your goals for the new year. But before you write them down and put them away for the rest of the year and right back to your old habits, consider these tips. Start going to the gym, save more money, eat healthier. Sound familiar? The new year for many people is an opportunity to start fresh, setting new goals and milestones we want to achieve in the coming year. But it's not always so easy. And it's realistic for me, which is the most important part. We want to set ourselves up for success. And so in order to do that, that means we need to make sure that we can reach our goals. Martina says when thinking about New Year's resolutions, you want them to be smart, specific, measurable, attainable, realistic and time bound. For example, if my goal for myself is I want to exercise more, it's hard to know what that really means. So we want to break that down. Maybe it's OK, I want to go to the gym twice a week after work that's specific, I can measure if I'm reaching it. Having something to measure can help you figure out what worked and what didn't work, allowing you to make changes and adapt. It's important to have grace for ourselves, be patient with ourselves, and also evaluate, is this the right time for us to be making our goals? You might feel the pressure to make goals at the start of the new year, but it might not be the best time for everyone, and that's okay. <laughs> A common resolution we always hear is going to the gym more. Yeah, the holidays are nice and slow. Everybody goes and sees their family. And then, of course, the food is eaten. And then that's when we get to work here. So. Oregon says the biggest obstacle is breaking down old habits. The average people stick to about six months. After six months, that's when things start to really whittle down. Um, if you and your mind can kind of conceive six months in before you get started, that's going to be your best bet. You say, I can do that. Something else that can help you maintain the goals you put forth is a written reminder. Somewhere you'll see it every day. It's really just looking at what you want in life and putting it to a visual aid. And then, of course, if you're looking at that on a regular basis, you're less likely to do the things that are kind of steering you away from that. Remember to acknowledge those wins, even if they are small. In San Luis Obispo, Kimberly Cruz, KSBY News.